Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Carolyn and her clothes. And today I have a stitch fix and it's a good one. Uh, my stylist is Shannon from Shannon Style. Um, I became friends with her via YouTube and it turns out that she's a stitch fix stylist. So she kind of knows my tastes and knows what I'm looking for. So she works really hard to try and find things that meet my tastes. And I want to say thank you very much because this is a great fix. I told her when I checked the, the checkout and I scanned, I'm like, woo, this has a potential to be a five out of five. <laughs> so I am so thrilled with this particular box. So I'm going to go in with each and every item for you. For those that don't know what Stitch Fix is, you pay them a $20 styling fee. They'll curate a box of five items, send back what you don't want, um, and keep what you do. That $20 gets applied to what you purchase. If you do not keep anything, you do lose that $20. I am grandfathered in with the style pass. I pay $49 a year and I, uh, I get unlimited fixes. I don't have to pay that styling fee. And again, shipping is free both ways. So it's why not? I mean, keep get, getting them until I find something I like. And this one was a good one. Okay. <laughs> so first up, I'll step back. I'm wearing a jacket. The jacket is by Steve Madden. It's the Electra Faux Leather, and again, it's a faux leather, and it's an off-white, size extra small for $109. Okay, so it's your typical Moda style jacket, but I do have to say it is very lightweight. It is 100% polyurethane. I'll zip it up so you can see the way it looks. Okay, there's definitely, it's an extra small, plenty of breathing room for me, plenty of movement, um, yeah. This is, this, this is a no-brainer. I mean, I don't need a motor jacket. I really don't. I really do not need another motor jacket. <laughs> but I don't own a one in off-white. This is a lightweight one, so it would be great for spring. It's very flexible. I am seriously considering this. And again, this one was $109 by Steve Madden. So this is a definite possibility. Um, I do have some credits my mother-in-law gave me, and I do want to use them up because I've been like doing freestyle and sending it back. Freestyle and sending it back. They finally just applied the last credits back in my account. I have like $150 to spend in credits. I'm not quite sure what I'm doing yet. Um, again, this may be a five out of five. I'm not 100% positive. All right. Next, I am taking off the jacket to show you this beautiful sweater that she found for me. The only thing I'm negative I have to say about this, and I know why she did it, she did size up to a small, probably because it was the only thing available, and it is a fitted style. But on me, because I'm short and it's not really fitted because it is a size small, but I don't think it looks that bad. You guys tell me, what do you think? I mean, I really like this sweater. Let me go into some of the details. It's a rib style. All right, it has these little cutouts going down the arms. It's in this beautiful periwinkle blue with the, the bateau or boat style neckline. It also has the scalloping down here at the bottom, which I do like. And this sweater is Evolution by Cyrus, the Quinley sleeve detail, the, 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 they're calling it life blue. And, and I was just saying I need more in this color. Size small, $58, not a bad price. It's 80% rayon, 20% polyester, and it is hand wash, okay? So this sweater, I think I need to keep it. I'm gonna look to see if the, an extra small came back in stock, and if they did, I'll do an exchange. Um, other than that, uh, I, I'm gonna keep this. I, I don't think it looks bad. I would prefer it a little bit more fitted, but I don't think it's bad at all. And it's a very pretty color. By the way, light blue is one of my favorite colors. And I think this is a great like spring sweater, okay? Um, next up, I have on these jeans. These jeans are by Can Can. They're the Charles High Rise Bootcut Jean in Indigo, size zero for $60. Again, great price, okay? So um, they, they are a little bit long, but again, I'm not wearing my heels right now, and, and most of you know that I do wear heels. Uh, but you can see they're not, I'm not tripping on them, all right? So they are bunching up at the bottom, but I'm not tripping on them. If I wear heels, they'll be fine. They're uh, no distressing on them. Let me hold this up so you can see. They're the traditional fly pocket style and extremely comfortable. They're my normal size zero and then they are 68% cotton, 30% poly, 2% spandex. Um, these are a possibility. These are a possibility. I might keep these and retire my plain boot cut that I have now because um, 
I don't know, I'll have to try them on and see, because I think they're like a little bit of a lower rise, and I like these that are a higher rise. So I'm gonna possibly think about these. The price is great. Um, yeah. All right, next up, and you're gonna be like, why did she send you sneakers, Carolyn? Because most of you know I wear my heels and not sneakers. Well, I do have one pair of sneakers that I refer to as my vacation sneakers, and they're shot, okay? So these are the, I do like a pair of like white or neutral sneakers that I can wear and look dressy or nicer on vacation. So I asked for these, I even had them pinned all over my board. These are the Gola Classics, Grand Slam Trident Leather, and they're calling it in tan, size seven, $110. The uppers are both leather and man-made materials, or they said other materials, I should say. Um, I will take a, this off to actually show you what they look like. And these are a definite keeper too. So I know I'm definitely keeping the, the sneakers. I think I, so far, I think I need to keep everything. <laughs> I don't know what to do about this, all right? So you can see right here, they're white, and then there's like a beige, um, I think it's in suede, and then like a tan suede, and then in back here, there's a pink and the blue, and they're my normal size seven, and they're comfortable, and these I actually need, <laughs> all right? And yeah, so I, I, I'm extremely happy with this fix. I'm gonna have to do some number crunching. I also have a wantable coming tomorrow, more number crunching. So I'm gonna have to see what I'm gonna be doing between these two boxes. But yeah, I do do like everything here. All right, give me a minute. There's one last top I can throw on. Okay, next up is this sexy top by LNA. The Nuri Cross Front Rid Knit Top in Black, size extra small for $88. It's 95% rayon, 5% spandex, and I think it's hand wash. Let me see what it is. No, Gentle Cycle Machine Wash. Um, yeah, this is a cute top. This is definitely a date night top. Lots of cleavage showing. Uh, I do like it, but out of everything, this is probably my least favorite out of everything because of the cleavage issue. I will wear tops like this. I have no problem with wearing tops like this, but it's just limited amount of wear I can wear it to. All right, here is the back of it. Okay, and I'll come a little bit closer so you can see the detail. You can see it's pretty low cut. You can see my cleavage, which again, I don't mind. It's just that, you know, basically a date night is the place to wear this. Okay, and that is my fix. What do you guys think? What would you do if you were in my shoes? I do have that credit. I gotta do some math and really think. I have to keep the goal of sneakers. I do like those and I need them. I think I'm gonna be sad if I return the light blue sweater, but I really wish it were an extra small. I'm gonna go on the app now and see if I can get it. And then um, I, I think I'd be kicking myself if I don't keep that moto. The jeans, I do like the jeans and they're a good price. However, they're jeans and there's always gonna be more jeans and they're not that distinctive. Um, so I'm thinking of keeping three things and possibly returning this top and the jeans. Let me know your thoughts. Thank you again for returning subscribers. I appreciate your support. If you haven't subscribed yet, what's holding you back? Click that notification bell, get notified of future videos from me, and give this video a thumbs up. Take care, until next time.